Alright guys, so since I don't have everyone together before we get there, I'm going to go over a few things. Um, I've got the totes here that our meat will come back in. I can have five bags, which totes count as bags, up to 70 pounds. So I can put 70 pounds in each of these containers. That should cover at least a few caribou. Um, so for now, we've got our food broken down by day. So starting Sunday, since we get there late Saturday afternoon, I'm going to work out um, what we're eating Saturday before we get there. But Sunday for the field, we've broken down um, our foods. So we're going to be using jet boil. We've got, I've got four meals for me and Sky. That should be enough. And then just some of your typical uh, energy type bars and some candy. We've also got um, some cookies and I'll have some almond milk and just some fruit for back at the, the lodge. Um, I don't plan on doing a lot of cooking as I doubt we'll have much time when we're there. We're pretty much just going to be sleeping and cleaning the animals. Um, we may cook some of the meat there if we wanted to, but I don't plan on cooking a lot. So um, that is that for now. All right, the next thing I want to show you guys is just my Google um, Earth of ADAC. So zooming in, this is oriented north south right now. So we will fly in one of these runways and we'll get off at the terminal here and they will take us to our lodging or we will they'll have a vehicle ready for us at the terminal that we can drive to our lodging at that point we can get unloaded and then um, either settle in for the night or um, depending on the weather um, we may elect to at least go out and start checking things out, if not um, even start going out and hunting. So in. Sky's 
guys are still pushing away. Doing great. We made it to the end of the lake. We're heading up into the pass. Beep boop. Ooh. Captain's logs. It's almost Halloween. We're on this strange island in a blue water ocean. We landed here yesterday. There seems to be no sign of intelligent life other than ourselves. We have yet to find the elusive caribou. So we are off to find those today. We've got a couple hours until the sun is up because it doesn't come up here until 8.30, 9 o'clock in the morning. So we will try to acquire ourselves some hydrogen and oxygen and uh, make some breakfast. What was last night like for you, Sky? <clears throat> mm, I don't really know. It, it seems like... Uh, I did get very hot, but at some points uh, I woke up and I was laying in the dirt, so. Yeah, was it cold then? Yeah, but I think since I'm really warm now, uh, since I got myself kind of moving, uh, I'm pretty warm now. Good. Did you sleep okay? Yeah, it was fine. I woke up quite a few times, but... Same here. Yeah. Luckily, due to the lengthened nights, we have more time to try to sleep, but... 12 hours of sleep. Uh, attempted sleep. But the wind, what was the wind like? Oh, it was insane. I think it was like 35 miles per hour or 30. I think we hit at least 50 or 60 knots last night. So, yeah, it was insane. Absolutely nuts. That is definitely some of the strongest wind I've ever been in, in a tent. Luckily, we have a mountaineering tent. She did well. She held sturdy. I just had to take the flap off the top last night, so I quit whipping around. But that's just to protect us from rain anyway. And yeah. it's uh, too cold for rain up here. It snowed on us multiple times. Yeah. Uh, that was kind of really... a sleet. I could hear that. It's like little balls of... Yeah. Um, Ice pellets almost. Exactly. So when I held my hand out last night, when it started to snow, I could see these little like dots. And they weren't like snowflakes, they were dots. Mm. The snow dots could be uh, something to that. Anywho, <clears throat> more on caribou later. We will find ourselves some water this morning. That's going to be priority number one and filling our bellies. And then hopefully the sun will be out soon and we can find ourselves some sustenance in meat. More from us later. Beep boop. What do you think? Cool. There, down there. 
here somewhere. All right, so it's about 10.40 in the morning and we've been out for almost two hours now. Hiking, made our way to Gannett Lake, which is this lake right here, over by those three ponds right there are four caribou and then over on these knobs right up on here there's two caribou that i've seen um, other than that we have not seen anything so all, everything we're seeing right now is pretty far away might sit tight for a few minutes and see if we see any more movement otherwise start making our way along this ridge line through the pass maybe and if we have to, potentially work our way across the river to Gantt Lake. stops. Oh, oh shoot, they're moving. Somebody's spooking them. Shit, someone spooked them. Come on. It's okay, it's okay. Come here. Come here. Stop it again. He's stopping again. He's stopping again. 